Today on Stu's Cookery Class, we're going to be making English pancakes really nice and easy. We're going to be taking one egg and 300 ml of milk. It's really important to do it in this order as this will help you not get any lumps. We're then going to add 110 grams of flour and whisk that in really thoroughly as well. I'm now taking a knob of butter and putting it in a red hot pan. You can tell the pan's really nice and hot because the butter's foaming. It just slides around in the pan really easily. You'll see here my butter's browning slightly and that's absolutely fine. We're then going to add a generous amount of pancake batter and swirl that around in the pan. When I swirl it around, I like to try and cover up all the holes and get it right around the edge. After a couple of minutes, you'll want to check your pancake to see if it's ready to flip, but mine needed a little longer here, so I gave it another two minutes. Now that it's nice and golden, the easiest way to flip a pancake is just with a spatula, and it's stronger than you think. Now I'm going to flip it back over to check the other side's cooked and you could crisp it up by doing this if you flipped it back over and give it a little bit longer on the other side again. But if you're wanting to show off, flipping pancakes is great fun. It's all in a sort of flicking wrist action and just takes a little practice. Now I'm a sugar and lemon guy but I used to know someone who put a mini Mars bar on top of their pancake and popped it back in the microwave to melt it. Um, if you like this video, hit that button, and if you really liked it, consider subscribing. Why not check out my chocolate fondant recipe, or how to make a blackberry and apple strudel.